it might not be such a cruel summer for Taylor Swift. A source tells Page Six that there's buzz around Swift's camp that the cruel summer singer and her NFL star beau, Travis Kels, plan to get engaged this summer. There are rumors the pair held off from having Kels pop the question over the winter holidays because they don't want it to seem like it's rushed insanity. Our source also said he won't go down on one knee for Valentine's Day for the same reason. Taylor and Travis discussed it and there is a plan, the insider claimed, but the buzz is. They will get engaged on their one-year anniversary in July, Swift. 34 and Kelsey's first public appearance was in September, when she came to watch him play at Arrowhead Stadium for his Kansas City Chiefs game. But Swift subsequently revealed in her Time Magazine Person of the Year interview that the duo was actually dating for much longer. The cute couple started to see each other after Kels, 34, talked on his New Heights podcast in July about trying and failing to give Swift his phone. Number at an era's tour concert, we started hanging out right after that, Swift told Time. So we actually had a significant amount of time that no one knew, which I'm grateful for, because we got to get to know each other. I think some people think that they saw our first date at that game, Swift added. We would never be psychotic enough to hard launch a first date. She also said, when you say a relationship is public, that means I'm going to see him do what he loves. We're showing up for each other, other people are there, and we don't care. The opposite of that is you have to go to an extreme amount of effort to make sure no one knows that you're seeing someone. We're just proud of each other. It was exclusively reported in December that the football hunk has asked the singer's father, Scott. Swift's permission for her hand in marriage, a source close to Kels claimed. Scott has been asked for his blessing and has wholeheartedly given it. And Travis has been talking to friends about a ring. The celeb couple just spent the holidays together with her family and his dad. They were also spotted packing on the PDA on New Year's Eve, reputation symbol. Adding to the reputation fan theories is that days prior. Swift also wore green to the Golden Globes. Her red carpet look was a long lime green sequin gown custom made by Gucci, which she styled with metallic green Christian Laubut and heels. The singer added some shimmer with D. Beer's jewelry, including cascading diamond earrings and a ring that coiled around her finger like a snake. Europe is already experiencing an economic boost as Swifties prepare for the era's tour. Taylor Swift's record-breaking tour will go to 18 European cities this summer. Swift's U.S. tour boosted hotel revenues across the country and affected the economy. Another day. Another drama, another economy stimulated. Taylor Swift is taking her era's tour to 18 European cities this year and the continent is already. Seeing financial gains? The financial impacts that Swift's billion-dollar tour had on the U.S. have been well reported. But the specifics of how she may rock Europe's economy are now taking shape. Hotels and short-term rentals in the European cities where Swift is performing this summer are already filling up by August 2023. Hotels in Cardiff and Liverpool in the UK, where Swift will be stopping in June, had already reached occupancy levels of more than 50% for her tour dates. Hotel research firm ST are reported. Given the rumors that Travis Kels recently asked Taylor Swift's father for permission to marry her, you might be concerned that these two are moving too quickly. If so, don't worry, apparently. They're eagerly awaiting engagement until this summer. After a full year of dating, Taylor and Travis decided not to get engaged on her birthday December 13th or during the holidays. An anonymous source added that they won't do it on Valentine's day -ite. Her because they don't want it to look like rushed madness instead. There is a plan to exchange rings on their one-year dating anniversary in July. Although ESPN cameras only started catching Taylor in September, she revealed in a recent interview with Time magazine that she and Travis started seeing each other over the summer. Shortly after he first mentioned her tour on his podcast, what will they do on Valentine's Day? Well... Travis may or may not take advantage of Etsy sponsoring his podcast and giving him a handmade gift. In a recent ad, he claimed to be feeling the pressure of Valentine's Day. 
and emphasized that the market is the go-to place to add that special touch. Taylor seems like the type of girl who enjoys personal grooming, or maybe he'll finally throw her a huge party, like he was supposed to do on her birthday. Whatever they do, I'm sure their plans will be perfectly balanced, simple, and not hasty madness at all. On Thursday in New York City, the star once again stepped out in green, which fans are interpreting as a hint about the potential release of her next Ray recorded album, Reputation, for a trip to Electric Lady Studios. The green piece in question was a casual scoop neck top, which Swift wore under a dark. White zebra print Adidas zip-up jacket with a collar and oversized pockets. The karma singer wore the piece with some black leggings and black tights, and accessorized simply with brown sunglasses, drop earrings, and a black necklace. Swift also showed her support for her friend Beyonce by completing her relaxed, sporty look with a pair of beige and white Adidas Ivy Park Savage Trail Ivy Topia sneakers. One of the Renaissance star's popular clothing lines with the footwear giant, Swift styled her hair into a sleek ponytail for the outing, and wore bright makeup and orange lipstick. The 12-time Grammy winner's relaxed solo outing came a day after she enjoyed a trendy girl's night, out with her pal Blake Lively. Next, Swift dropped some major Easter eggs with her ensemble, a crunchy green velvet mini dress, sheer black tights, and pointy thigh-high calfskin boots from Jimmy Choo's latest collaboration with Jean Paul, Gaultier. Decorated with hand-drawn tattoo-style illustrations of snakes, the ultimate symbol of reputation. If you find this content suitable for you and you will like to have more contents like this please take some time to subscribe, turn on notification button so that you will be the first to watch the next video, like, comment and share this video. Thanks for watching.